So I thought it was about time I start reviewing some um, some women's pleasure tools. And here it is. The women's pleasure tool. The ultimate in heart technology. Uh, uh, <clears throat> yeah, this, this review took me a while. Mostly because every time I went to try to go and do it, I like... I double think or I didn't know what the fuck I was like. I didn't know what I was talking about when I was do, when I would do it because I didn't know how to review it. I didn't know what to tell you about it. <clears throat> Obviously, this thing is not. <clears throat> this thing is not for, you know, don't, you're not going to use this as a pro. You'd look like a real ass bag. Carrying this thing on the job, to, you know, if you're an electrician or something, you know, you'd look like, you'd look fucking stupid. Don't, don't get that in your head. That That's what I'm trying to get at here. It's been in the kitchen drawer for like, hmm, damn, I don't know, six months, four or five months, maybe. And yeah, and it's weird. And I thought it was just going to sit there. I bought it, my wife, you know, I was like, oh, cool. And I threw it in there. I was like, yeah, whatever. I'll probably never use it and probably never do a review on it because when am I going to use this fucking dildo looking thing? I mean, honestly. But surprisingly enough, this thing being in the drawer has been just fucking convenient. And I got a drill in the house. But this thing is more convenient than that drill in the house. Like, we take, uh, put a, putting a crib together. We put a crib together. Uh, we put a, um, put a little be kid's bed together. Um, hung a TV. Well, obviously, I didn't drill into the drywall, but you know the fastener is going to the back of the TV. Um, I forgot what else. Been a few different things. Hung some pictures. Um, and removed some cabinets, doors, and stuff. And it's just surprisingly convenient. Like the handle is convenient to to use. And I just keep this cheap bit set inside the house. Uh, On today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to cut a zip tie. A good guy would cut it like this, but I'm an asshole. Fuck your arms. I think I already broke. Oh yeah, we'll talk about that for a second. So I got these. There's these cheap security bit sets. So they're the same thing as the Harbor Freight, but they're tool sh tool shop. Same thing as Harbor Freight, so exactly the same. And I think if you guys follow me on Instagram, you'll see that um, I took apart uh, the little fan assembly thing for the uh, power. Um, for a power cord for a, an Xbox 360 to clean it out and it uses these stupid little security torque set bits so I, I had this and I used it and it, it snapped the bit like the very I actually had it on the wrong setting I actually had it in forward rather than reverse which forward and reverse is just as simple as moving the switch but anyways, yeah, I moved it in reverse or forward, and then it was like, uh, dink, and it just snapped it off like quick, faster than I could re react to, you know, let go, I guess. And I mean, this thing will spin out of your hand because you want to have the tendency to hold on to it lightly, but you you need a you can, it's not going to spin out of your hand, but it's surprisingly torquey. Let's just put it that it's that simple. It's surprisingly torquey. So. Anyways, I did that with it, and, like, I haven't charged it. I've done all those things, and I have not charged this thing. I have no idea how much battery is in here, because there's no battery indicator whatsoever. But, I mean, it's... It's not like a... It's not a flimsy piece of shit. It's not exactly built the best. Obviously, there's huge panel gaps there, you know, and... Obviously, I'm not beating it up. It just slides around in the drawer. I drop it a few times on the floor. That's about it, and obviously, you get a nice big paddle switch in the back. It's surprisingly convenient, guys. It's actually really weird because I have that little DeWalt drill in the house and I'll use this on those little tiny project type stuff just sitting around the house. I swear I'll, like, if the drill is closer, that DeWalt drill is closer, I'll use this first. If I know this thing will have enough power, you know? If you're just assembling basic shit that you don't need tighter than screwdriver handle tight. Because you can use this as a regular screwdriver. I mean, it's an awfully large and inconvenient screwdriver at that point. But you can use it like a screwdriver so yeah let, let here I'll show you let's do a little demonstration okay so this is like a one inch piece of 
Uh, wood. I don't know what type of wood. Well, let's see if I know how to use a drill. Okay, so as you can see, okay, so it's not tight, but you're, you're not getting it out of there by hand, right? Right, so just to demonstrate that, let's get the front lash right there. Uh, reverse, there we go. So as you can see, I can take that out by hand, but it's not loose by any means, I, I can't just, I can't, you know, so anyways, you can throw that in reverse, put that on there, I mean, it's, con it's just convenient, it, it really is, especially like, uh, that's faster than you can do it by hand, that's for sure. I mean, you can bury that thing. I mean, that thing's buried in there. So, it's it's kind of it's kind of weird. It's it's surprisingly torque, and the only reason is just my wrist. I couldn't. I literally couldn't hold it tight enough to push farther. But it'll back it up, as you can see. And this thing is not fully charged. I mean, I've, like I said, I haven't charged it in months. And it's still going. And it just uses a, uh, basically like a spring in there that holds on to the side of the bit. Kind of a, a spring um, steel clip type of thing that kind of just gives it friction. Kind of locks it in place. Not bad. They don't fall out at all. Even these longer bits. You know, they don't fall out or nothing. They're about... They're better than this. If you own this magnetic one but from Milwaukee, it has a stronger hold on it than that does, for sure. So, yeah, there's that. But it's it's really weird. I mean, I bought it solely for the channel so to, to review it. But it's strange how I've, I'll choose this way over, like, the DeWalt. I just keep saying DeWalt drill because it sits in the same drawer. And I use this first. I don't know why. <laughs> It's, it's the strangest thing to me, but it's just, it's really cool. It's convenient. It's just fucking convenient just to go up bing, and take it out. Like I'll clean my dryer out. I'll take, I've done, yep, I've done that a few times. I'll take out the screws, clean out the, all the dryer lint out the bottom that falls out, that the lit, the catcher thingy doesn't catch. I'll do this too, because it's just convenient. Stick my hand in there. Don't have to use a screwdriver. The drill doesn't quite, just because of the handle part doesn't quite fit right. And this, I mean, I'm, I'm genuinely confused by this. I don't understand why I liked it. Now, would you buy it? Hundred bucks? I mean, hundred bucks? Jesus, hundred bucks? No. Um, twenty bucks? Mm. Yeah, it's pretty convenient. It's pretty convenient for twenty bucks. It's, uh, it sure beats me having to come out to the garage and grab anything else. And I just keep a bit set there in the house. Damn. I mean, you could. I mean, I still wouldn't. I still keep have a drill first. Buy a drill first. Don't have to be from Hart or no, nobody or whoever. You know, to Bauer. This one's actually pretty neat. But um, no, I'll stick to my Milwaukee's. But yeah, like I said. So keep it fresh. I'm all done here. I don't know what else to tell you here. Buy it. Don't buy it. I don't know which one to recommend. It works really well. And it has a lock. Put that in the middle. Won't do nothing. So, And it's it's not going to hurt kids. Like The kids can put whatever. It's not spinning fast enough to do anything. You know. But it's strong. I mean, don't get your hair tied up in that thing. It's It has, it has some torque. It's kind of weird. More torque than you can really easily apply by this motion I guess I guess if you did it right like that you might 
so yeah check it out guys facebook instagram uh twitter and tiktok they're all i'm all on all of them so you know stay safe out there keep it fresh